Can you simplify this expression? Let's learn how to solve it together. So here you can see that we have the square root of 50 plus the square root of 18, all divided by the square root of 32. Now the first thing we're going to do is actually split everything that's underneath the square root into factors. And specifically, we're gonna divide each of them by two. And that's gonna allow us to do something really interesting. It looks like this. So we have the square root of 25 times two, which is obviously 50, plus the square root of nine times two, which of course is 18. And finally, it's all over 16 times two under a square root, which is of course 32. Well, now that I've got these products under each of the square roots, I can actually apply the square root to them individually. And it looks like this. So I have root 25 times root two, plus root nine times root two, all divided by root 16 times root two. Now we know the square root of 25, the square root of nine, and the square root of 16 because they're all perfect squares. So if I substitute in all of the perfect squares, then I get five root two plus three root two divided by four root two. Now the final step before everything becomes glaringly obvious is to actually divide each term by root two. Dividing each term by root two will cancel out all of them and that'll leave us with something really easy. 5 plus 3 divided by 4. Well, obviously 5 plus 3 is 8, and 8 divided by 4 is very obviously 2. Did you get this one right? Let me know in the comments.